For what purpose the gentlewoman from Pennsylvania seek recognition? Mr. Speaker, I ask for unanimous consent to address the House for one minute and to revise and extend my remarks. Without objection, the gentlewoman is recognized for one minute. Thank you. This week, horrific anti-Semitic flyers were distributed across my district in Pennsylvania. I heard from friends and neighbors who found flyers in their front yards or in their driveways. These hateful flyers were found in some cases by children. I'm not going to show nor repeat the flyer's disgusting words because that's what those who spread hate want, for people to amplify their insidious message, one that is on the rise as the Anti-Defamation League records year-to-year -year increases in anti-Semitism. I am a proud Jewish American, but anti-Semitism isn't just a threat to those of us who are Jewish. It is a threat to all of us because anti-Semitism, like other forms of bigotry that spread lies and stoke hatred, is an existential threat to our values as Americans. It takes all of us, drawing strength and community from one another to stand up to those who want to divide us. Let's keep standing together so that united as neighbors, we can root out the anti-Semitism and hate that endangers our fundamental American values. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I yield back.